What's going on, everyone? I'm just a typical average American here today to react and learn about I Am Canadian commercials, which apparently has to do with, from my understanding, Molson Canadian beer. And before I start watching the commercials, I'm just going to get a little context here, as I like to do, to understand exactly what I'm dealing with. So this is a little description of the ad campaign. I am Canadian was the slogan of the Molson Canadian beer in 1994 to 1999. And 2000 to 2005 made a bit of a comeback. <laughs> Don't know what happened for those six years. Or sorry, one year. Then made a bit of a comeback. I am Canadian was the slogan. It was the subject of a popular ad campaign centered on Canadian nationalism. Okay, yeah, it's like... I don't exactly know what to expect with these commercials, but just the phrase, like, I am Canadian. Like, don't get me started on how much pep and <laughs> energy that would put into Americans. We, a commercial that's just like, I am American. You know, <laughs> that'd get you drinking a beer or two. So I get it. I like it. The, the most famous examples are the rant and the anthem. Ads appeared in English, Canada, and the U.S. I never saw these. Uh... <laughs> When was this? 1994? Would have been a little early for me to be watching the beer commercials. Um, and just a little information on the company. I've never really heard of Molson Canadian brand of 5% lager beer by Molson Brewing. Okay, cool. Does it still exist? Yes, they have five breweries across Canada. Why is it so good? Oh, apparently it's good. It's good stuff. That's good. Using crystal clear water, the finest hops, and Canadian-grown malted barley. F Molson ferments each brew to produce a smooth, refreshing beer with a genuine Canadian taste. This is becoming a, a, a Molson Canadian beer ad without even playing the ads. So, with that being said, let's waste no more time. I'm very interested to see, because, uh, I don't know. This, has, this video has a lot of views. A lot of people seem to know about these commercials. I am Canadian. Canadian nationalism and beer. This ought to be good. So, let's see. Okay. These are snow globes and we have a lot of them. We should get more. They're really cool. Okay. Okay. All right, guy, oh, it's a lot of beer. Guy walks into a store, making a little eye contact with the woman at the front. I can, I can see how this is gonna involve beer, maybe. Is he gonna like get a beer and like be all impressive or something? Oh, what? Oh, oh. What's he doing with that moose? He did. I thought he was going to grab a beer for sure, but he grabbed the moose? Is there even going to be beer in this commercial? Hi. Hi. <laughs> I wow. <am> Canadian. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> that, is, that is not at all. Not at all where I thought that commercial was going. What? She just had some bad teeth and a weird voice. Like, <laughs> not very polite, not very Canadian of him to sprint out the door. Hi. <laughs> this is funny. This is pretty absurd. Man, if I had just saw that commercial with no context at all, I would not have like thought, oh, beer commercial? Thought beer was going to be in it, but that was funny. I didn't know these were going to be funny. All right, I'm, I'm excited now. <laughs> so you're from Canada? Yeah. Do you know Glenn from Canada? He works in an office in Canada. He plays hockey. He plays <laughs> <day> a lot. <laughs> of course, Office Glenn. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> these are good. These are actually good. Like, <laughs> all right, she's being annoying. Asking if all Canadians know each other. He hits her with the perfect... <laughs> no, he's dead. Shuts her right up. <laughs> of course, Office Glenn. He's dead. <laughs> I am 
<laughs> I like, you know, these are a little edgy. Makes a lot of sense with the brand. Um, I'm a little confused because it was supposed to like, I don't know, the description I thought was, I am Canadian was like nationalistic commercials. Like, all right. <laughs> so, so far it's like a lot of commercials about men with beer having like negative interactions with women. So I don't know. It, <laughs> they're definitely funny though. Are these supposed to be? Oh, it was the subject of a popular ad campaign centered on Canadian nationalism. Yeah. And the rant and the anthem are good ones. I don't think we've seen the rant or the anthem. I don't think so. I'm not sure. They don't really have names. But let's continue. I'm enjoying this. <laughs> For the first time ever, the United States has become the first nation to walk on the moon. Yeah. In this golf ball. Oh, a puck? <laughs> oh. Wait, that's kind of scary. Wait, that just broke. Is this a Canadian on the moon who hit a, a hockey puck into the American? How could you? That probably would kill him in real life, but luckily this is a fictional beer commercial. Oh, uh, Ottawa, we have a uh, problem there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's good. That is, that's good. That is... These are good. What the heck? Canadian! Sorry. I don't know. Oh, he's got tape. He, did, he didn't suffocate and die in the vacuum of space, just to be clear. He taped up his helmet. I'm glad they showed that. I don't know why I'm surprised, but I don't know. <laughs> just for pulling up a random compilation of commercials. I guess I just didn't know what to expect. Beer company. These are pretty funny. Sorry about that, eh? Oh, they're friends again. Oh! So I hear you're from Canada. Yeah. How's it going, <laughs> eh? <laughs> and this is the second or third commercial. Yeah, third. Wait, this is the third commercial that seems to have like a doofus or annoying uh, or <laughs> something American as like the butt of the joke, which I don't mind. They are very funny. <laughs> Do you want a donut? I thought all they had up in Canada were uh, lumberjacks and curlers. <laughs> oh boy. Is there running water up there? <laughs> oh <your> man. <laughs> where's, where's your toque? You know, whoever made this commercial did their homework. They're referencing the they're referencing the toques. <laughs> New dude beauty. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, Wait, I thought something like Maybe there's a little more to it, but it seems that that Canadian was just going to straight up beat him up. So <laughs> that's kind of funny. He he kind of deserves it, to be honest. Canadian! <laughs> no, yeah, they kind of cut it off, but that Canadian was not going to stand for that. So I actually, I respect it. That American was going in a little, you know, much too hard and disrespectful. Does Do all Canadians wear toques? That's just <laughs> unforgivable. There's an unwritten code in Canada. If you live by it, chances are you've left your coat on some pile and knew it wouldn't get stolen. You've never made a move on your buddy's girlfriend. You know that on a road trip, the strongest bladder determines the pit stops. You've kept all your hockey trophies. You've replaced someone's pint if you knock theirs over. If your buddy's in trouble... <laughs> this is, these are so... I get it now, by the way. I get why... I don't know how famous these commercials are, but they're well done. The comedy is on point. They are memorable. This one is about, <laughs> if you're Canadian, all the nice things you might have done. These are good, man. You've kept all your hockey trophies. You've replaced someone's pint if you knock theirs over. If your buddy's <laughs> in trouble, you've got his back. You wow. clap for the dancer even though she shouldn't be a dancer. You've used a blowtorch <laughs> to curve your stick. You've used your arm as an ice scraper. And oh. you've grown a beard in the postseason. This oh, yeah. is our beer. Most okay, this is more of a classic. This is what I thought it was going to be. Classic beer commercials that at the end, at some point in the commercial, they're holding up the glass of beer, like looking all delicious or something. This is the first one that's done that, which I kind of respect in a way that, you know, this is very in your face marketing. Although the, the part leading up to this, where they're talking about all the funny things super nice Canadians are probably doing in Canada, that's not funny and original. And this is the only kind of salesy part. All the other commercials are just like, you're going to remember them solely on the comedy. And then at the end, it's like, 
Molson beer. And it's like, oh, that was a beer commercial. Molson Canadian. There's an unwritten code in Canada. Oh. If you live by it, chances are you have a hockey scar somewhere. You've gone <laughs> Another one of these. On a road trip with a car that had no business going on a road trip. You're proud <laughs> to know a girl who got jiggy with a pro hockey player. You feel kind of bad reclining your seat in an airplane. You've used a <laughs> cheesy pickup line only because your buddy dared you. Wow, this, these are good. What are the two I'm supposed to look for? The rant and the anthem? Oh, I'm not sure if I've seen them yet. This one's very good to me. I was wondering if this commercial is like the rant or something. You fill your friend's pint before your own. The you anthem. think hockey tape can fix anything. You've gotten <laughs> kicked out of somewhere and you've oh. turned down a booty call in the postseason. This is our beer, wow. Molson Canadian. Yeah, the, though, these last two are like very beer commercial. Very beersy. Like, what? It's an unwritten code in Canada. If you live by it. There's an unwritten code in Canada. So there was a sequence, a series of these types of commercials. I think they realized that how clever it was, the unwritten code in Canada of stuff you do. <laughs> these are good. I don't mind that uh, it repeats this idea a few times. I see why they did that. Chances are you've driven an hour for 19 minutes of ice time. You've been to a oh. bar that starts with Mick or ends in Anigans. You appreciate oh. a woman who's into sports. You'll call anyone with goalie equipment a friend. You know what a J-stroke <laughs> is. And sometimes... A ja see, that's why I'm not a ca not Canadian. I don't know what a J-stroke is. Your skating is worth watching. You know the sippy <laughs> cup lid isn't as dumb as it sounds. You've worn a canoe as a hat. You've assembled the barbecue. And they're not dense. They're goals. This is our <laughs> beer. Molson Canadian. Wow. Okay, so not all... <laughs> not all just polite Canadian-isms. But just funny Canadian things to do. It's funny. <laughs> it's also funny to me a bit meta that this Canadian beer commercial is pointing out sort of stereotypical Canadian things that uh, Canadians, like, it's a little bit overboard like that, but at the same time in, within the realm of possibility. Um, I'd like to see, man, this just makes me want to see like an American equivalent. Like, what are Americans doing that could make a funny beer commercial? Or maybe I'd be a little scared to see that commercial. I don't know. There's an unwritten code in Canada. If you live okay. by it, chances are you've overcome bad directions to find your friend's cottage. You know what happens on the ice stays on the ice. You've okay. come face to face with some kind of freaky bird. You hold a pint <laughs> with all. You've come face to face with some kind of freaky bird? Really? Is that something? And they, they're like chasing it in their house. How'd it get in there? And you have a net? Five fingers, and it's never okay to rub another man's rhubarb. You know the last box in is the first to get unpacked. Your soap smells like soap. You've guesstimated a phone number. You've cooked with a flashlight, and... You've guesstimated a phone number, or cooked with a flashlight? I'm, I'm learning things here about Canadian culture through the beer commercials, of all things. I had no idea there were these types of things Canadians did. Interesting. You like to cook at night or something, or, I don't know. Can't you write down the telephone number? Why do you have to guesstimate? Or, I have some questions about these. You recycle. This is our you beer. You recycle. <laughs> Americans are terrible at recycling. That's actually no joke. That's actually very nice, the recycling part. These are, okay, the, the Canadian unwritten code. I wonder if this is one of the more well-known uh, sort of ad campaigns for this company. Molson Canadian. 36% of Canadian hockey fans think players should be allowed to have more liberal curves on their stick. Okay. Oh. That's a curve. <laughs> oh. Wow. Wow. That, like, funny? But I think I'm just impressed at how, like, I, I'm just appreciating how clever these commercials are. Incorporating some Canadian hockey into the beer commercial, the curved stick, picking up the beer. These are just, like, clever, which, I don't know, I guess as an American I don't expect out of beer company advertising. These commercials are actually smart. <laughs> Funny. We agree with them. <laughs> Wow. Molson Canadian must be pretty popular. Like, I feel like this campaign must have done extraordinarily well. According to the Google search earlier, 
I mean, this campaign went on for 10 years total, right? Dude. <laughs> hey guys, look what I found. Oh, oh wow. Beer, 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 beer. Oh, when we get together, just me and all the lads. <laughs> this must be the anthem. I know there's one called the anthem. Yep. This must be the anthem, because... There you burst into song. Everyone remembers all the fun we had. Wow. Every time we gather, there's plenty of good cheer. Imagine finding meat. That calls for a bubba beer. Introducing the Molson Bubba. Wow. 14 bottles. Wow. Wow. Applause. I, I have also, like, an appreciation for, like, older commercials when they used to actually go the extra mile and create, I don't know what you call this, a jingle? An anthem. An entire song. Someone wrote a song for this commercial, which is like, I feel like you don't see as much anymore. That used to be in more commercials. It's, it's a bit of effort, and it pays off so well. That is such a fun, good, freaking beer commercial. I tell you, I'm becoming a big Molson a uh, Canadian lager fan today. It's a beer big and perfect for any occasion. <laughs> hey, coach. Listen, I can't play today. I'm really sick. <coughs> you too? We're about to play Canada! I can't. I I'm sick. Gotta go. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. It's taking a shot at the Americans again. Oh, that's funny. The American hockey player doesn't want to show up to work. Doesn't want to show up to the hockey game. Because we're playing Canada! And we're gonna get our butt whooped. Oh, that's funny. Look. <coughs> <laughs> it's it's also funny that this is a Canadian commercial. It it, it goes like two ways. Because if this commercial is shown in Canada, all the Canadians are like, "Ha ha! Those Americans are too scared to play us in hockey." Was because we're gonna whoop them, rightfully so. And if it's shown in America. I, don't, I feel like a lot of Americans would find it very funny because I do think most Americans know or at least associate Canada with hockey and therefore being really, really, really good at hockey. So <laughs> this is good. Canadian. <laughs> Canadian, please. Ooh, Mr. Canadian. Mr. Canuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. And another commercial with the arrogant, annoying American guy who's dressed up kind of nerdy, uh, really making fun of and antagonizing the Canadian who just wants his beer or, or is at work. Like, this is, this is amusing to me, too. If, if this, this was shown in Canada, it kind of shows Americans being jerks. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <gasps> Where's your pet beaver? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oh no. Oh! Right here. <laughs> Attack. <laughs> These are so good. These are so memorable. And they're such good beer commercials. Memorable, good, a little edgy. So sometimes having people dying <laughs> through dying in outer space and getting their neck uh bitten open by a beaver. That is good stuff. No! <laughs> wow, I imagine Canadians like me, uh, or Canadians enjoy this a lot, like I do, I should say. I imagine Canadians, Canadians enjoy this quite a bit, and I did as well. Man, I am Canadian commercials. Well, uh, Molson Canadian Beer Company marketing team, you have done well. You have done very well. I'm sad to hear that this is a, uh, this ended in 2005. It's been gone for almost 20 years, this commercial campaign. What a shame. I never got to see it, but I'm so glad that now in 2023, I guess, on YouTube of all places, I finally got to enjoy a condensed uh, viewing of the Molson Canadian, I am Canadian commercials. These are fantastic. Um, gosh, these are Funny? Memorable? I don't know. Just good. Like, just from a marketing point of view. Like, I'm like, wow, this is, like, well done. I'm happy to be, like, advertised in this way. 
you hate when the little pop-ups and annoying ads with stuff you don't care about pop up, but when this kind of thing pops up, these commercials that have been thought out and are genuinely comical. Like, I don't mind. I don't think anyone does, really. It might even encourage you to get a little beer, <laughs> which no one hates. So it's good. I enjoyed this uh, thoroughly. Anyway, if you enjoyed this as well, feel free to give this video a like or leave a comment. And if you're interested in more videos like this, me reacting to Canada and Canadian culture and just stuff from Canada that I've never seen before or learned about, feel free to subscribe for more. And until then, thanks for watching and see you next time.